Hello everyone, Jeffrey Sambrowski here. Today we're doing another reaction video and today we're reacting to the Project Tiger Moth pilot episode known as The Good Old Days, which is a Thomas the Tank Engine video made by the one and only Flying Pringle. And basically Flying Pringle, you might know him from portraying himself in Project G1. He's also the the person that designed Rolly the coach. You know Rolly. And uh, he has offered us this interest, this really cool looking video called Project Tiger Moth. Uh, he said he's working for a while on, I think during Thanksgiving of last year of 2022, I think. Yeah. So anyways, I'm pretty curious to see what this video is like. I know it's, it's, he said that it uses like real life model replicas as seen in like seasons one through 12 of Thomas and Friends. And yeah, I'm just generally curious to see how this goes. So let's get to it in three, two, one, clicky clack. We are right back on track. This actually looks pretty good. Holy crap, this reminds me of when I was watching the classic model series of Tom's and Friends. Damn, this is amazing. All right, here we go. The good old days. Narrated by Robert McGee. Um, I guess he's the narrator. And this is directed by Flying Pringle himself. One morning, Toby the tram engine so there's was feeling Toby. Glum. The other engines were busier than ever, but poor Toby So far, this looks really good. And read it for weeks, only shunting freight cars in the yard. Just then, Gordon puffed in to take and on there's water. Gordon. Oh, hello, Gordon, said Toby sadly. Are you pulling the express today? Who else but me? Huffed Gordon. You're lucky to always have passengers, remarked Toby. Well, you know, there's Henry Gordon being pompous to Toby. This long without passengers since. Well, not since my old tramway closed down. Then Toby remembered. It was back in the good old days. Chuckle Hence the title of the episode. Oh yeah, we that's footage from, line, from the actual freight, episode that Toby and first appeared in. Henrietta was always bustling with passengers. They'd visit us on holidays and always remember Nice homage holidays. to season one. But then they stopped coming back. My line was closed and the good old days were over. Yeah. It would be nice to have my own tramway again, sighed Toby. Like having my own branch line. Oh, snorted Gordon. Branch uh, lines. Smells like really accurate to the model That's series of Tom's of hot cares about. That's amazing. Roof, anyway. Just then, Thomas puffed in with some freight cars. There's Thomas. I saw Toby, looking dismayed. What's the matter? Asked Thomas. Oh, just miss being useful, replied Toby. If I could just have some work to do, he said sadly. Thomas smiled. Well, you can take that train of building supplies to Percy for me, said Thomas. They're needed up at the work site of the new main line extension. Then I'll be able to collect Sir Totten Hat early, and you'll have some work to do. Toby was excited, though the extension was news to him. Come on, Toby, said his driver. We'll take Thomas's branch line to give you a nice long run. Toby was now beaming with joy. He reversed on to the train of supplies and set Pretty off. Pretty cool the how they did this uh, train show. But as he puffed you know, down the line, he couldn't stop like filming thinking there. what Gordon had said. Sir Topham Hat really does only care about the main line. I'm really, I'm really amazed at how they got these shots of the characters running Meanwhile, and the camera Percy movement. Fuming. Where's like Thomas? Toby front I'm exhausted. View. He can play. He'll be here soon. Suit this driver. I think some of these might be actual the props, surprise. like the Percy prop Percy and the What's driver surprise? prop. Probably they got Almost restored or something. Answer. Like Toby restored as in fixed Here up. Here the building supplies, Percy. He panted. Toby, what are you doing here? He snapped. I'm sorry. Thomas said I could deliver these supplies for him. Is there anything else I can do to help? Percy eyed a long line of freight cars full of scrap and tree branches. You can so take those trucks. cars back to the yards for me. He replied. The train looked quite heavy for Toby. But he agreed. He rolled onto the special junction. Toby's always willing to help. To change direction. He then buffered up to the heavy train and was on his way. 
Soon, Toby was pushing the heavy train of freight cars up a big hill. He made a tremendous effort, but just as uh -oh, he reached the top, the weight of the cars wrong. became too much for him. Uh -oh. His driver shut off steam and applied Chose the brakes. Up to their tricks to again. Late. There was worse to come. As Toby thundered toward the work site, he saw Percy dead ahead on his track. Look out, Percy! cried Toby. Toby rocketed past Percy into some bushes near the work site. Toby shut his eyes and braked with all his might. Snap! Go, Toby! And at last came to a stop in front of an old station with an old shed. When Toby opened his eyes, he couldn't believe where he was. Percy pulled up behind him. Are you alright, Toby? He gasped. Toby was bubbling with excitement. Percy! This is my old tramway! And look! Toby there's found my old his original shed. home! I, I, I never thought I'd see it again! Just then, Thomas arrived with a work crew and Sir Topham Hatt. He spoke sternly to Toby. You should know your own strength by now, Toby. He boomed. Once again, these I'm miles sorry, look sir, really amazing. But I only wanted to help. I'm aware of that. I'm just glad to see you safe. Though it's a shame you've spoiled your surprise. surprise? Toby was confused. My surprise, sir? Sir Topham Hatt smiled. Yes, Toby. Our new extension is in fact a restoration. We are like restoring I said, restoration. Connecting your tramway with the main line and Thomas's they restored the props. Toby grinned from buffer to buffer. He almost couldn't believe it. Oh, sir. Thank you, sir. He cheered happily. When the restoration was complete, Toby and Henrietta took a special charter of friends, old and new, down the line of an opening run. For Toby, it seemed the good old days were here to stay. Wow. That was cool. Oh, oh that was amazing. Gotta sh give shout outs to all these people that worked on this project. I'm giving shout outs to all these guys. Not gonna get that all the names because one that's gonna take way too time. Gonna give him a group shout out. Decade David Minnan. Aw. Rest in peace, David Minnan. Wow. Now that was amazing. And it was definitely nostalgic, too. Um, things I liked about this video is, like, I like how the fl how Flying Pringle and all those other guys of the Tom's fandom made actual props as well as restored props that they managed to, you know, get, for, you know, to use with, I think, Mattel's permission and stuff. Like, it, it's really amazing how they did that. And... I've been seeing a few, sh like, teaser shots of these on Twitter, like, of how the progress of this was made. Like, for example, some of the props. And, and Flying Pringle, if you're watching this, you did a really amazing job on this video. Shout out to you, my guy. Keep up the good work. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this reaction video. And what do you want me to react to next? This is Jeffrey Samberski signing out.